Welcome to the Accu web hosting video tutorial. Today, we will guide you on how to install the Let's Encrypt SSL certificate in the Windows VPS without a control panel. If you want a PDF file of this video tutorial, you can download it from our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting. We have mentioned our Telegram channel link in the description. Kindly click on the link and find the PDF file of this video tutorial. Before we begin, take a look at AccuWebHosting.com to review various hosting services offered by us. You can contact us through chat, phone, or send us an email at sales at AccuWebHosting.com. Let's begin the tutorial. First of all, we will check the prerequisites. You should have administrative user access via remote desktop protocol. IIS server should be pre-installed on the server and should have a live website. The website must be pointed to your server. In this tutorial, we will use secure.demovpstest.com as an example. What is SSL? SSL is a global standard security technology that enables encrypted communication between a web browser and a web server. This encryption ensures that important data such as usernames, passwords, and credit card information is sent from the user to the site without the risk of interception. The main use case for SSL, TLS is securing communications between a client and a server, but it can also secure email, VoIP, and other communications over unsecured networks. HTTPS, Hypertext Transfer Protocol Secure appears in the URL when a website is secured by an SSL certificate. Let's take knowledge on what is Let's Encrypt SSL. Let's Encrypt is a certificate authority that provides free SSL certificates for websites. It provides the trusted SSL certificate and browser recognizes Let's Encrypt certificates as trusted certificates. More details about Let's Encrypt you can get from their official website. Let'sEncrypt.org In order to use an SSL certificate, you must have a valid domain or a subdomain name. Also, the domain must be pointed to the web server through the DNS server. For this tutorial, we have created a subdomain, secure.demovpstest.com, and pointed it to our Windows server. Let's check the website and SSL status of secure.demovpstest.com. This is our secure.demovpstest.com website and we will install SSL on this domain. Let's check the SSL status of secure.demovpstest.com by the online tool. As currently SSL is not installed on the domain, SSL checker tool is showing the warning, no SSL certificates were found on secure.demovpstest.com. Make sure that the name resolves to the correct server and that the SSL port, default is 443, is open on your server's firewall. Let's see how we can install a Let's Encrypt SSL certificate on a website that uses IIS for the web server. Let's Encrypt uses the ACME protocol to verify that you have control over the given domain name. In this tutorial, we will use the WinACME client as it is open source and actively developed. It can generate and renew SSL certificates. WinACME is an ACME version 2 client for Windows servers that aims to be very simple to use. It has a very simple interface to create and automatically install certificates on the IIS server. 
the first thing is to download the WinACME package on the server from their official website www.win-acme.com. First, you will have to log in into the server using the remote desktop application. We have successfully logged in into our Windows server. Now open the web browser on the server. Now open www.winacme.com to download WinACME package. Click on the download button and then click on recommended version. We are downloading the current latest version 2.1.22.1 on our server. Extract the zip folder that downloaded and save it where you need it. In my case, I saved it in the downloads folder itself. After that open the directory and double click on the wacs.exe. The WinACME interface will open and it will look as shown on the screen. For creating a certificate you need to type N and press the enter. The WinACME client will scan your live websites from IIS and will show the results. Press the number shown in front of the site. In our case, the number is 11. So I entered 11 and press the enter. Now choose our website binding by entering the corresponding character. In my case, it was A. I selected all bindings as I have only one binding. Confirm the selection by typing yes. If you have installed SSL in past, it will ask the replace the existing task. Confirm it by typing yes. That's it. If your domain is pointing to your server, it will successfully generate an SSL certificate for you. It will also add a scheduled task that will automatically renew the certificate when it will be due for renewal. The application will also install the SSL certificate for you. Now we can quit the console by typing Q. Let's check the website and SSL status of secure.demovpstest.com. This is our secure.demovpstest.com website and we have installed SSL on this domain. Now website is accessible using the HTTPS protocol and shows the connection is secured with a valid certificate. Let's check the SSL status of secure.demovpstest.com by the online tool. You can see that the SSL checker tool is showing that the common name is secure.demovpstest.com. Server type Microsoft IIS 10.0, issuer lets encrypt, validity 89 days, certificate chaining, along with additional information. Let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We saw. How to install the Let's Encrypt SSL certificate in the Windows VPS without a control panel. Hope. This video will be helpful for you. If you like our technical videos, please press the subscribe button and bell icon to receive instant notification of our new videos. Each like is important to us so do not forget to symbol us. To download a PDF file of this video. Please subscribe to our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting, where you will have access to the PDF files of all our videos.
Thank you for watching.